It's been a while since that happened. Weird. I'm not overcharged either. What was with that power surge? Rose, what was that? Oh, um, nothing. Just, I, uh, lost control. Are you sure? Oh, yeah, I'm sure. Alright then. Aren't you late? Late? Late for what? I thought you were opening the cafe with Celeste this morning. I... Oh, Vora, how could I forget? I switched with Heike this morning! Don't worry, we'll pick up something to eat on the way there. And a new kettle. I'll clean this mess up when I'm back. I... Alright. Thank you, babe. <laughs> no problem. We've been on and off again and again I don't know which way we're going No control You push me then you pull me back in Don't know if I can decipher How your mind works Yeah, you leave me wondering What it's like to feel your skin I will keep on trying till You give me a sign Give me a sign Oh, give me a sign Baby, give me a sign Thanks, girls. Of course. I know a lot's been happening. I hate myself for everything. This is why women are better than men. Oh, yeah. How's it going between you two? Um, we're taking it slow. I'm kind of figuring out myself. At least you can figure it out. I'm a literal bomb and my fuse is upstairs unknowing. I think we should go out. Ooh, yes! A girls' night out? It's been a hot minute since last time. You girls would... really do that? Of course we would! Even though we're dating, or at least trying to, it'll be like old times. Yeah, um, sounds great. <gasps> Yay! I keep it in here. What's up? Where are you? You're late for opening. What are you talking about? I swapped with Rose. I went out on a date last night. Oh yeah? Yes. Oh girl, you need to tell me all the spicy details. There wasn't anything spicy. <laughs> Liar. Anyways, aren't you on the clock? 
Um, yeah? Then maybe you shouldn't be talking to your boss like that. Anyways, Rose should be there any minute. Knowing her, she probably just slept in. Yeah, I guess. Can I just say how unfair it is? You two have totally hot boyfriends, and here I am, lonely and single. We'll talk about it later tonight, alright, Celeste? When we aren't working. Wow, that secret chopper really got you, huh? Of course. Rather we are able to work together over getting separated. Alright, fine. I think I see Hunter pulling in. He might have Rose with him. Alright, see you later. About time, I need someone in the kitchen to get everything going, because I keep burning everything, or it comes out soggy, or it comes out- Are they still in the back? Uh-huh. Alright, let me see what I can do. Rose? Don't worry, this is... normal. Normal? Yes. I think he's gonna freak. Jessica is going to freak. I'll call 911. My magic, it's, I... Your magic caused this? I, I, I'm sorry, Miss Peyton. Oh, Vora, what is this going to cost me? It'll be closed for a couple of weeks at the least. I... What is going on with your core? I've never seen it this out of control. I don't know. Is this business proprietor? Me? Sir, is my cafe going to be okay? The kitchen only had some minor damage. I would suggest speaking with your insurance and get a contractor to get on it right away. Um, yes. Follow me, miss, uh, how you say? Oh, Jessica Payton. Right, miss Payton, uh, if you could follow me. Just great, what happened? Look, my powers, they've been out of control. Powers? You used your magic? I always do when the sweets, well, aren't perfect. Just a little rejuvenation magic. Rose, if they can't track the source of the fire, insurance might not cover it. Yeah, yeah, I'm... Oh my Vora, Rose, are you okay? <laughs> Yeah, don't don't worry about me. It's probably just the mage bug that will be out of my system in a few days. A mage's bug, eh? Yeah, it's obvious, isn't it? For a normie and a celestial. I'm calling Christina and Marina. Don't disturb them, Heike. They are on their honeymoon. I know, but we need to make sure. Ugh, fine. We'll go to my apartment. I'm sure you don't want this discussion out in public. Yeah, um, I'll let my mom know.
I feel awful for interrupting them. That's why they gave me this. It's a magical communicator thing. Guess just in case some crazy stuff happens while they're gone. That's some next generation stuff. Hey, Heike. Hey. Is your magic on the fritz again? What? No. Weird. I'm feeling an intense presence. That would probably be me. What? Oh, you gotta tell me. Who is that, honey? It's Heike, Rose, and Celeste. Already a fire in the mist? That part I don't know yet. Look, Rose hasn't been feeling well today, and has had two massive magic explosions in the past 12-ish hours. Uncontrolled, or, well, not aware of. Rose claims it's just a mage bug, but we wanted to hear from you guys, being my personal mentors and all in this world of magic. Interesting. Marina? Yeah? Any thoughts? On what? Rose, you don't feel her? That's not Heike? No, I'm surprised too. Rose has always been a quiet one. Well, let's clear out a potential one. Is there any possibility you're pregnant? Pray. Okay. <laughs> um, it could be possible. Heike won't spell the spicy deets, but Rose certainly will. When was your last period? If I'm being honest, I'm irregular, so I don't really know. Then I would suggest testing at least just to, well, eliminate that possibility. Can't you just, like, I don't know, detect a new core? It's not even developed yet. Most won't have their core fully developed until the age of five. I... I see. I would definitely get testing done, though. But how? Since I'm a mage, I won't- A normal pregnancy test should be just fine, Rose. Oh, Vora. Don't worry. If it's negative, you're probably right and it's just a mage bug. Just the joy of being a woman. Yeah, um, thanks. Is that all? Um, that is everything. <laughs> Thanks. Great. I'll talk to you later, alright? Yeah, sure. There's a dollar store nearby. We can pick some up there. Some? Like a couple? Yeah, just to confirm it. I- I see. Ah, Celeste! We might be aunties! I know! If you want to baby... So bad, then why don't you just get pregnant, Heike? Oh, there's a difference between being, being an auntie and being a mom. Well then, here I go. Don't worry, we'll be here when you're done. So, you're quite invested in both Rose and my love life. Quite recently, what happened to the secret admirer? He ghosted me. Oh, I, I am so sorry to hear that. It's whatever, though. I should have known eventually he would have gotten bored with the one-way communication, but he never gave me a return address. <sighs> that sucks. Whatever. I mean, at least I get to be the auntie that buys the most annoying toys. Girl, we don't even know that yet. Let me hold on to the positive just for a bit. Alright, I mean... What is this place? We actually found a place in Rosegate that allow you to be, well, yourself. Myself? 
You mean... Pop your ears and tail out, girl! But what if someone sees me? There's a zero snitch policy here. I didn't have to give into the pressure 